Hello guys, this is Reese from Bomberito St. Peter's Volkswagen in St. Louis. Today, I am bringing you a 2022 Volkswagen Passat Limited Edition. This particular one is pure white on the exterior with marl brown interior. This is the final version of the Volkswagen Passat for the US. There will no longer be a Passat in the US for sale as a new car. This one features alloy wheels, keyless entry on two doors, LED headlights, LED tail lights, LED turn signals and reverse lights, faux exhaust tips at the back there. It says Passat right here below the Volkswagen logo on the back. It has park distance control, keyless entry, push button start, remote start, heated seats, heated rear seats, a power sunroof. The LED headlights also have AFS or adaptive front steering so they uh, turn when you turn the wheel. It has a limited edition badge or a limited badge right here on the front quarter panel. Black mirror caps and these wheels are unique to the Passat Limited. Let's take a look inside and before we step in You'll notice the marl brown on the door inset right here. Also wood grain interior right here. Really, really uh, good looking wood grain interior. Of course, it's not real wood here, but it is actually uh, a really good design there. It continues across the dash in the car there. And the car's going to ding because I have the ignition on. Here's a look at the seats. These are leather seats, real leather seats. Uh, they, they are marl brown and they do have the black two-tone feel here. Uh, let's take a look at another car real quick here. Adjustable headrests in the back and car seat hookups in those two rear seats. On the tags on the seat here, Volkswagen Chattanooga since 2011. That's when the Passat first came to the U.S. and was built in Chattanooga. Had a very successful run. You have lumbar support right here on the front, forward and back and up and down right here in this middle one. And then you also have a seat back adjust here, three seat memory. And as we climb in, and you're gonna see lights on, it's because this car just got PDI'd and uh, I have the ignition on because it has zero miles to empty on gas. So the engine is actually off, um, but uh, I'll go over things in the car anyway. Uh, nice flat dash across here, just like in the other Passats, just like in the SE and the R-Line. Uh, wood grain across here. Very, very nice looking wood grain there. Nice color, nice hue to it there. Uh, you do have automatic headlights right here. Dimmer switch is right here. And then you still have that telescoping steering wheel with the piano black finish on the three spokes. Pull out, push in, raise it, lower it, and then the piano black surround around the uh, Volkswagen logo there too. Uh, your volume control right here, and then your uh, song skip and preset skip is on this side as well. Nothing really changed for 2022. I mean, the car's getting ready to go away, so um, th this is the final year for it. So um, there was not any need to update anything or change it. Your clock set buttons are here and also here. Uh, the same uh, dial here for the speedometer, and then you have the customizable LCD screen in the middle right there. Uh, you do have a coin box for storage over here on this side. Uh, stainless steel pedal caps down here. The footrest is just regular, the regular footrest there, but you got pedal caps on these here. Uh, the radio is going to be AM, FM, and satellite uh, right here. From home nowadays. And I'll turn that down a little bit there. So you do have AM, FM, and satellite there. I'm going to go ahead and start it up for a moment here. It is going to say zero miles to empty. So um, there's a look at the radio there. It's an AM, FM, and satellite radio. I put my foot on the brake, put it in reverse. I do have just the regular backup camera. It's an HD camera, but it, it's static. The green line stays put, the red line stays put. You don't have trajectory steering. Uh, but you do have uh, navigation. So navigation um, is with the SD card. The SD card isn't installed in here, but navigation will show up here. Um, you do also have App Connect. App Connect is going to allow you to do Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, or MirrorLink. 
um, using a wire or a cable right here with this USB. You do have phone storage down here as well, and you have a 12 volt charger port right there. Dual zone climate zone for cli uh, climate control up here, so heated seats as well, three phase on each side. Uh, and then you do also have the auto button and then, uh, of course, um, the AC, uh, max AC and max defrost buttons as well. Uh, the good old fashioned handbrake right here, that remained, um, and then the, the switchblade key fob. So you have the flip out switch key, switch blade key there, uh, remote start is right here, trunk release is right here. Uh, and it is, this is not a power lift gate or tr power trunk. So all that's gonna do is unlatch it for you. Unlock here and lock here. Uh, panic alarm is on the side of the key, of course, right here on the side. Um, but that's the same key. Now, I want to see if I can get this to show up here. This is the, I believe this is a map of Chattanooga right here. And this is a map of the of the plant. So this cup holder down here in the rubber here, you, if you can see that, there's the Volkswagen Chattanooga plant right there. I'm trying to point right there. Okay, and I think this is actually Chattanooga or surrounding Chattanooga area near the plant right here. So that's very nice. And then they did do um, the seat numbers here. This is one of 1973. Number one of 1973. Actually, it's one of 1973. Uh, correction, so they're doing one of 19... They're all going to say one of 1973. It's just... Uh, they're not gonna like count the numbers. There's storage in there as well. Uh, notice it's a black armrest here. It's leather red as well. There's a look at your inset over there. Very nice, nice spot for a cup holder there. Over here in the glove box, there's your SD card uh, and then your manuals. And there's also a storage shelf up here. People swear that they didn't get their manuals, uh, but there's a shelf up here that's stored out of the way that keeps that out of the, the glove box for you there. Uh, I'm going to actually shut it off again here and go to the back here. Here's a look at the, Well, actually I'm going to turn on the The ignition and leave the engine off so I can open the sunroof for you well, There's a look at the sunroof. It's a regular twisty knob right here And then you do have that override of course as well. I twist again and that override takes it all the way back There's a pop-up windscreen right there And then just twisting again to the front brings it all the way back Carnet will be free for five years on the car. Uh, that's roadside assistance, emergency services, and what have you. Uh, you do have an auto dimming home link mirror on this one with a digital compass there, three door garage door memory, a vanity mirror on each side with an LED light right here, and also right here. Sunglass storage right there. Now let's take a look at the back seat. Oh, and it, there is a remote trunk release right here as well. Before we hop in the back here, this one comes in at 32,100. Extras on this one are gonna include the auto dimming mirror for 325, mojo mats for 260 bucks, Volkswagen prepaid schedule maintenance for 140, and then a roadside assistance kit for another 85, bringing you to the 32.1. As we open this up, here's a look at that back seat. Very nice, very comfortable. We know it's gonna have a lot of leg room. They didn't change that at all. You do have the wood grain continuing in the back door panel as well. And then you also have this inset right here with Marl Brown as well. As we climb in here, there's a look at your magazine pocket there. And these seats feel like they're a mile away from you. Same on both sides there. I have easily 12 inches of knee space back here behind this seat. And I was just sitting in that seat up front. This is a car that's known for if you have a tall driver, you're not losing leg room or headroom. Or you're not losing a seat by having a tall driver because they tend to have that seat all the way back where it collides with the back seat in this case i can actually cross my legs back here so there's my socks right there i got my leg crossed with the help of my hand there i have to pick it up i'm not limber enough anymore to do that but there's a look through from the back to the front the instrument cluster center console armrest i look up at that sunroof right there car seat hookups are right here you can see the metal clips right here on each side for the two outboard seats these two rear seats are also heated there is your fold down armrest right there it's squishy yet firm it's a little hard plastic on the corner right here uh adjustable headrests on all three seats here's a look at your vent setups here you have the little rotary dial here to open and close the vents or adjust the wind speed or fan speed there uh you also have heated seats on both sides three phase 
and two USBs for charging back here. So you have a total of three USBs in the car. Let's take a look at the trunk. This alloy wheel here, very nice, very reminiscent of the Passat Sport back in 2016. And if you look in the trunk here, a massive trunk, lots of storage space here, and there's a seat pull on either side. You do also have a roadside assistance kit here, cargo blocks, uh, the mojo mats here, and then the cargo protection system, and underneath the floor right here, there's a look at your spare tire and jack apparatus there. Very nice. Park distance sensors are right there at the rear. The Marl Brown interior looks great in this car. This car will also be available with the Marl Brown with a racing green exterior. A very nice setup there as well. This car comes with a four year, 50,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty on it from Volkswagen. It's four years, 50,000 miles, and includes two years of free maintenance. So your 10 and 20,000 mile oil change are covered by Volkswagen. Also, if you buy from me at Bomberito St. Peter's, I'm gonna give you a third year free maintenance on any car that you buy. Uh, the exceptions to the rule will be a car like this one where it has three years of free maintenance already included. This has the 30,000 mile on the window sticker. Um, however, we will still give you a 10 year, 200,000 mile nationwide engine and powertrain warranty free of charge. As you hear a plane fly overhead, remember you can fly in and drive out. 10 years, 200,000 miles of engine and powertrain warranty added to any new car. Give me a call, 636-290-4257, 636-290-4257. I'm on Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter at Reese Sells Cars. Thanks a lot, guys. Stay safe, stay healthy, have a great day.